offensively. And let's face it, this drive is not going to have any bearing on this game, but it's kind of important for one reason, isn't it? It certainly is. You got to get points. And okay, all right, I'm being facetious here, but you get points, you feel a little bit better about yourself as you move on to the next one. And throwing to start the drive, but that one incomplete. Well, it just seems like all game long, there hasn't been a lot of sync quarterback to wide receiver on this side of the football. They haven't been on the same page quarterback and receivers. Heck, they haven't been on the same grease board when you draw plays up. They haven't been on the same surface tablet that you look at on the sidelines. Nothing's worked for them. They've got to find a way to start matching each other's movements. Throwing over the middle, and it's incomplete. He was trying to get it to A.J. Brown that time. And now it's third down. He's defended by Patrick Peterson. A shotgun snap for Tannehill. Into heavy traffic, and it's intercepted. Picked off at the 40. And they'll start with great field position at the 41-yard line. How about one last great play defensively, and that should, for all intents and purposes, finish off this shutout. That's as good a defensive performance as we've seen in a long, long time. And I know as a team they will celebrate, but I will guarantee you the defensive guys, they'll get together somewhere and have their own private celebration. A shutout, that's something to be cherished. Following the interception, Mayfield, they set up the screen to bow. And he's going to get a solid gain of nine before being brought down. Second and right at a yard. The Chiefs will use the first of their timeouts. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stage. 